yesterday you were having a conversation with a friend and uh, he asked me if i think the Rigadi Gashagwa's uh, impeachment thing is political and i told him that mm. absolutely Rigadi Gashagwa's impeachment is political what are the grounds that are provided by the 20, 2010 constitution on impeachment of a deputy president position the grounds are three and they are clear that uh, a deputy president can be impeached upon when he, when he violates or she violates the constitution of Kenya. Two, on um, gross misconduct on the office of the president. And thirdly, in a scenario where the deputy president is experiencing mental incapa in incapability of conducting duties that are tied to that office. Those are the grounds that forms the impeachment stage for a deputy president in Kenya. But if you, if you look on the impeachment motion that is allayed, does it meet those grounds? It doesn't meet, but William Ruto uh, has, has insisted on impeaching Rikadi Kashago. Look it from this angle again. And a motion has to be passed in the National Assembly by at least a third of the members. It's supposed to be taken to the Senate and Senate is supposed to conduct its, in, its investigation in two, in a, a 10 day span upon which the Senate is supposed to vindicate or not vindicate those allegations. Of course, we know if the Senate conduct its investigation right now, you automatically know that the outcome of these allegations are going to be null and void. So what happened? Yesterday, the Director of Public Prosecution, Renson Ingonga, approved charges against some notable characters again around uh, Rigadi Kashagwa. Teori, Gakuya, and um, uh, I don't know the other two. Uh, one of them is uh, former MP, Mwagi Kunjuri. Uh, and um, the investigations that are focused on these alleged people are, are that uh, they planned and financed and mobilized the finished June Mandamano. Of course, there are some accusations that um, they committed some crimes such as um, felony and uh, potential money laundering. These allegations are tied back to Rigadi Gashagwa. For what reasons? To form grounds on um, gross misconduct and, and uh, gross violation of the constitution. And I'm, I'm very sure that they're going to tie this to a point that it can, uh, it can give the threshold to impeach Rigadi Gashagwa. But here is where the problem is coming in. For you to impeach a deputy president, you must have two-third uh, majority of the Senate. Is President William Ruto able to acquire the two-third uh, majority of the Senate? Because as you know, oh, as, as you all know that um, Carlos is not, is not in for this impeachment. Who is not in for this impeachment? There are some section of senators that have sworn their allegiance to Rigadi Gashago. Where is William Bruto going to get this two third majority? That is the main reason. That, that, that is the main reason why has been so daring and telling William Bruto to outstar him in the public. My take is 